So once we do the angiogram, we can inject a dye and nicely see the lesion or the blood vessel abnormality in the spine. This is not a dangerous investigation. Usually, a Today, in next gen neurosurgery, we will discuss another aspect of investigations in the spine. If there's a suspicion of arteriovenous malformation or a blood vessel abnormality in and around the spine, angiogram is the best investigation method to diagnose the problem. So once we do the angiogram, we can inject a dye and nicely see the lesion or the blood vessel abnormality in the spine. This is not a dangerous investigation. Usually a small tube entered through a blood vessel and inject the dye and see the uh, abnormality. And at the same time, sometimes we can uh, inject a glue and block that abnormal area and treat the problem also. Otherwise, once we diagnose the problem, we can do a surgery and correct the problem in the spine. So therefore, this angiogram is an important modality of diagnosing spinal issues. And patients should not be worried about this problem because it's done by an interventional radiologist who has experience and these dyes are not toxic to the pe people. However, the results of these investigations are really helpful to treat the patient's problem accurately and quickly.